You, um, the clip we just watched, you know, watching it again, and I've seen it a couple of times before this, and it's just devastating, and watching him go, and he's just at the lowest point a human being can possibly be at at that point, and, yeah. and plays it brilliantly, but was there a point when you wrote it, were, were there scenes you had to take out that were just too much, that you felt would be too much, because this is full of tragedy, this, this story? It is full of tragedy, but it's also full of um, the amazing things that people do when they're faced with tragedy, whether it's their own or somebody else's. And, uh, you know, that's something that I've realized more and more about the film. Um, it's just that, uh, you know, as we speak all over the world, people are in terrible trouble. They're in hospitals, they're in battlefields, they're in morgues, and their relatives are there and their friends are there in situations they don't want to be in. Just performing these incredible acts of everyday heroism and just being there for each other. And, uh, you know, it's not, I'm not a, I do not have a Pollyanna attitude towards life by any means, but it is really moving to me how, how persistently and uh, uh, deeply Peter, people are devoted to each other when they get into trouble. I mean, when you just think about your life and anything that's gone wrong and who showed up for you and what times you had to show up for somebody, walk into a room you never wanted to be in, but you went in anyway. And that's one thing that really um, came through a lot for the, in the story. That said, there were things in the movie that we shot a scene that we did cut of the children's funeral, Casey's children, and uh, it was beautifully shot by our cinematographer and Michelle Williams is in, uh, there uh, in another amazing scene uh, out of, you know, she's half a dozen scenes in the film. But, you know, in trying to be respectful of those kinds of situations that people really have to go through, you don't want to push too hard and you don't want to hammer the audience over the head with it because nobody needs us to explain how tough life can be. I mean, you guys know that without being told by me. And so we, it was clear in the editing that this beautiful funeral scene was too much. Having seen this flashback and, and the knowing what happened to the family, it was clearly just abusive to go that far, even though the characters had to deal with it. The, there's no, it was, there's a line between uh, reality and, uh, and fiction where, in a funny way, the, the, the fiction is stronger in, in a sense of communicating itself. Uh, and, and it's just, I don't know, there's something about it that was too much for me and we took it out. 